Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna to be talking about this year's Christmas update in Fortnite. So if you're excited for this video, do me a solid favor, drop a like, subscribe if you're new, let's hop straight into it. So obviously the Christmas update is not out yet and well, we can compare it to last year for sure. Ooh, nice, we got an AK and a half pot. That's a good chest. So anyway, last year it did come out on December 18th and it lasted for 14 days or two weeks and every day we were able to unlock a new gift in the game. And I'm guessing they're gonna do something very similar to this this year. And of course, the 18th is not for like another week and a half or so. So it would be like next Friday, not this coming Friday, but the one afterwards. But it, I think it could be on Thursday because Fortnite likes to do a lot of their updates on Thursday. So it could be on December 17th instead. Oh my God, that was a weird glitch right there. So I don't know any information about it, but they are definitely adding more Christmas skins into the item shop right now. So they're getting ready for this update very soon. And then of course, there's all the snow on the map that comes along with it. I'm really hoping that they're gonna be doing this because that is probably my favorite part about it. Oh, look at this, there's a vault here. These are pretty rare. They give you 100 gold. Oh my God, look at that. I've only found like four of those this whole season. That's pretty cool. There's a guy in the water right here. Oh my god. Alright, we're gonna push this guy. What? He literally just blew himself up. Okay, that's weird, I guess. <laughs> Somehow we got the kill for that. That's interesting. Honestly, though, it is like really awkward in the water there. It's kind of hard to get out of. Don't really like that. And last season, they did a really good job with the Christmas update. I really loved how everyone was able to get all these free gifts. And then, of course, the map being covered in snow was really cool. So I'm definitely looking forward to it. I think Christmas and Fortnite is probably one of the best times, in my opinion, to play the game. It's just got good vibes in it. And it reminds me of one of my favorite seasons, which was season seven. So I'm sure you guys already know this, but the supporter creator system is back in Fortnite, but I still can't apply because apparently YouTube has disabled it right now. They're still working on that, so it kind of sucks, but I'll let you guys know for sure when I get a code. I am so excited for it. Honestly, cannot wait. I was thinking about rocking a Christmas skin today, but I'm like, nah, we're just going to throw on the wreath back bling. You know, we're keeping the Mandalorian skin on all the time, but I just added a little Christmas touch to it. And by the way, guys, like a couple days ago, I did record a video that never got posted. I actually tried getting the exotic double barrel shotgun. As you can see, I don't have a ton of gold right now because I spent it twice and literally both times I got the gun, I died. So it kind of sucked. So that's why I didn't post a video in the last couple days. I would have, but it just didn't turn out right. These bunkers are very bizarre. They, I believe there's only two of them around the map. There's one, of course, in Hunter's Haven. And then the other one is actually in Stealthy Stronghold in the middle of a jungle, which is really bizarre. No one really knows what they are. And this symbol, I think, has something to do with the seven, which is a huge part of the Fortnite storyline. And I believe there's only four of the skins out so that we could be seeing another one of those skins soon. But I also think it these doors, since you cannot break them, literally go down like into the people who are like controlling the map. You know, like we saw in the trailer with Jonesy in the office with the zero point and all that stuff. I have a theory that those doors lead into there and that's why we cannot break through them. Also, sand tunneling was re-enabled. You can see here, you can sink back into the sand finally. I love this ability, it's so much fun and it's actually really good movement to get around the map. Like it, it's, oh, I don't know why it popped me out there but it's like really fast. I've never actually been to this spot here, what the heck? Like this season, I've been here before like in previous seasons, but yeah, not this season. Jeez, there's a huge battle going on down here. What the heck? There's like four people. What is going on? Oh. It's the um, IO guards. I hit him for 39. Oh, we got a little sweat here. Oh my God, a little sweaty boy right there. He is gone, see you later. Blue tack for me. Oh, he had a P90. Jeez, we need to chill out here, oh my God. 
Oh my god, that actually scared me. Holy moly. Yeah, he's got a sniper. I don't want to peek that. Oh my god, I hate fighting in this tree. Alright, got a good tag on him. Oh my god, these trees mess me up so much. Jeez. I think he might break it down. Just to be safe here. Where is this dude? Okay. Jeez, there's a sweaty little guy right here. No, 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 there's no way. It won't reset, it won't reset. Oh my God, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my God. Jeez. Apparently the wall would not reset. I tried like four times. That was weird. Well, anyway, guys, if you're excited for the Christmas update, drop a like. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys later.